What's up guys? Today I'm coming to you guys with another album review. This month I reviewed We Are Not Your Kind. And now we're going to be reviewing some more Exit. Ah, let's get that. I wanna save you, but I'm not gone. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Josh, and y'all already know we're here to review this album. And how did I get introduced to Samo? Now, I'm pretty sure not too many people out there have heard of Samo, which is a grand shame because, oh my gosh, I can't wait to talk about this album. But how I got introduced to Samo was I was in a Discord, so, Discord, Discord, Discord server, and they were playing one of his songs. And I was like, okay, this guy sounds pretty good. And they were like joking around and stuff, you know, it was funny. They were playing, um, Star is cool. The sex was good, they said the sex was good. But in that song, I like that song, it's pretty funny, it's pretty cool, I like that one. It's off the exit. So, um, and I was just like, oh, okay, you know, what is this all about? You know, what is Samoa about? What does he got, you know, how, you know, does he have any albums? And he has albums, he has Exit, uh, is the only one I know of. I know he made another, he has another one, I just can't remember the name of it right now. But I don't remember Exit, because I'm uh, about to review it and I listened to that one like freaking crazy. So what did I think of Samo Exit? Is it worth y'all getting it, picking it up, buying it, listening to it, streaming it, doing your thing with this album? And my honest opinion, oh god yes. <laughs> like, y'all need to buy this. Y'all need to spread the word of Samo, because Samo is that guy, bro. Oh my gosh. This album was truly astonishing. It was amazing. It was, ugh. Oh. Oh, I loved it. I I freaking loved it. Oh my gosh. I think previously I said We Are Not Your Kind, which I love We Are Not Your Kind, don't get it twisted, was my favorite album of this year. But I honestly, I gotta bump it down to number two of my favorite of this year and gotta put my boy Samo up there because he did so good with Exit. I love this album from top to bottom. It was amazing. The interludes, uh, the way he closed it, you know, the themes. Oh my God, let me just talk about the themes on this album. There are so many things, topics, and stuff that he touched upon in this album. He touched, touched upon heartbreak, um, change, growth, love, um, you know, being alone, just wanting to keep, like, being in your own space, you know, just keeping your distance. And, you know, people that you don't need no more, you know, um, <laughs> girls going crazy, you know what I'm saying? Um, you know, there's so many topics, spirituality, um, individualism, God, religion. He just touches upon so many topics in this freaking album. He fits it all so well. And I'm just here like, Samo, calm down, because like, he touches upon it so well. He gives each individual topic, you know, it's due song or songs on this album. The songs flow so well, by the way, but um, you know, the themes, he touches upon them so well. Like, um, you know, moving on is a song that just got me like, feeling real light skin, I just be like, I'm moving on. <laughs> I think mean, my feelings, I'm like, hold on, some more. Some more, chill out. Like, oh my gosh, he did really well. Um, gosh, there are 21 songs on this album. Um, I think this album, if I was, Guess the length would be it's it's an hour and some change. I'ma just say some hour and some change, but it's well worth an hour and the hour just go like that. It's it, it, like I said, it flows really well. Samo's vocals. <laughs> I'm about to go. Oh my gosh, Samo. Let me talk about your vocals, bro. Your vocal ability is absolutely amazing. It's astonishing. It's great. I love it. I'm just like. Bro, the way he delivers notes or how he holds on to notes is just like, bro, like you're you're not human. Like I'm just like, oh my gosh, he's oh God. so well, so well. Um, you know, uh, he. I'm sorry, I'm all over the place, but like this album, I'm so for real, is legitimately so good. It's so good. 
I love it. I just, oh, he did so good. He did so good. I can't wait to uh, listen to his next album. And I'm surprised that I haven't really seen too many reactions to his albums. Like, I was looking up uh, a reaction or, like, a review to the his album Exit or, like, any previous other songs. And I haven't really seen reactions to it. Like, this artist, Simone, needs more clout, more attention to his name because he... He's done so, he's doing so well. He's done so well. He's a, a vocal lyricist. He's just a gift. <laughs> he's just a gift, bro. And I'm so glad that I was, I'm in that Discord server because, like, if it wasn't for that uh, voice chat, I would I would have never found out of Samo. I would have never known about his music. I would have never found out about this amazing, amazing album, Exit. Please go buy it. <laughs> Please go buy it. Um... You know, there are so many songs on here that I just love, that are just great. Like I, like I said, the way he puts time dedication into specific topics and, you know, issues and themes. And I'm just like, holy crap. Um, the way he closes the album, I love. Um, this, the closing is ironically called Exit. But, um... He, Exit is just like, you know, like a, it, it sounds like something you hear in church, like before the pastor goes up about to say, in, in Jesus, you know, it sounds like something that they, they play before, you know, you go up, you know, the Exit is like, it's a song, the instruments give you time to reflect and, you know, think about what you just learned and got from this album, just reflect and just be like, damn, Samoa, <laughs> you just, he just like, I want some more. Like, I want some more of this album. I was upset with this album, man. Just like We're Not Your Kind. I was like, really? It's over? Gosh. Um, you know. So, yeah, this was so good. Um, 21 songs. There it wasn't a song where I was just like, oh, can we skip this? Can we just move it along? Can we, like, ugh. I was in tune with every song especially like i was with the interludes like uh uncle gary for example is where his uncle i guess i assume would be his uncle was talking about you know you're with your homies and he's not he's the same he hasn't changed if no one hasn't changed like that's a problem y'all still talk about the same issue i was talking about when you was 18 your homie hasn't grown like come on it's just like wow like you didn't yeah, that's a problem. Like, you think about all these issues and topics, and it makes you think, and just like, holy crap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's speaking facts. He's spitting that knowledge. You know what he's talking about. And how Uncle Gary transitions into seasons. I'm like, <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just starstruck. Um, You know how spiritual, I think it was spiritual amnesia, I think it was called. If I got it wrong, I'm so sorry. But it's spiritual amnesia and how it goes in the king God. And he's like, we were, I'm not even going to try to say it because I ain't trying to put disrespect on some old name. I got to work on my singing voice. But, you know, how it led into that. He was talking about, you know, we as black people, we was kings before we were slaves. Always remember that. I'm just like, go preach some more. Hold on. Go ahead, pastor. Tell the congregation, bro. And, yeah, it was so, oh, uh, bruh. Bruh, I can't get enough of this album. I, I, yeah, y'all have to pick it up. This is an A+. Plus. Ah, the A+, plus, baby. It was an A+, plus album. This album was great. I loved it. Like I said, it's my favorite album of the year. I really enjoyed what he talked about, what he touched upon. Um, the length of the songs were great. They all fit where they needed to fit. Um, the interludes were amazing, like I said. Uh, <laughs> the songs were just... Uh, um, my top songs off the album. Moving on... Uh, it's a tie between Moving On or King God is my top one. Moving On is just so, like, a song that gets me in my feelings, makes me think, and it's just like, bro, why are you doing this to me, Simone? Don't do me. Don't do me. <laughs> Shout out to Star is Cool. I love Star is Cool. That's my second uh, favorite off of the album. I just love her. It's like, oh, hype beat, and, you know, you know, he, he, he talking about some girl, you know, he trying to, he trying to go crazy with it. Um, reasons. Uh, no, no, no. It goes moving on or King God. Then it goes reasons. Then stars cool. And reasons was just like, <laughs> my love ain't going nowhere. I, I'm just, <laughs> yo, 
Yes, bro. Um, four. What would be my number four? Seasons, number four. And number five would have to be... Oh, gosh. Yellow Diamonds. Love Yellow Diamonds. I love how he's talking about, you know, himself. And, you know, he's talking about how he's, you know, he's per good the way he is and stuff like that. Love Yellow Diamonds. And, yeah, that's all I have to say about Samo Exit. Have y'all heard Samo Exit? You probably haven't, but if you haven't, please buy this album. It was so good. My review, me talking about it, doesn't do this album justice. It's so good. I loved it. And y'all, honestly, have to pick it up. Anyway, leave in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit the little bell so you can get notifications. That little... What? <laughs> what the... What was that? Hello. <laughs> Hit the little bell so you can get notifications whenever I post. Anyway, have an amazing day. Be great. See y'all later. Peace out.